Yo, what is going on YouTube? Before we get in this amazing video, I wanted to say if this video gets 100 likes before an hour and a half, I will be double uploading. So if you guys wanna see another video, which I am on PC, so where it's gonna be a lot better quality and stuff like that, let's get those likes. Make sure you guys go drop a like, like right now. Like, go like the video as I speak. Like, go. Did you like it yet? See, you're trying to troll me. Like, I know you're sitting there thinking, like, do I actually like it? He's gonna end up giving up. No, I actually like it. All right, I'm, I'm gonna trust that you liked it. If you didn't like it, just know that you're fake. I just wanna let you know in advance, you're fake. But, ladies and gentlemen here, we have every single sneak, every single video that is currently out there um, to the mass public about Project Slayers 2. And Project Slayers 2, eat my chicken skewer, is going to be the biggest Demon Slayer game to release. As in, when it releases, I'm sure it's going to have a player count that no other Demon Slayer game has hit. So, let's start here with this screenshot. So, according to the sneak page, they're going to be adding a housing system inside of Project Slayers. So, I'm wondering if, like, that's literally going to be, like, a rentable house, like, that you can, you know, potentially stay inside and that's going to be, like, the thing. That would be sick. That's something that we haven't really seen, um, not even just in Demon Slayer, but a ton of different RPGs. So, I'm wondering if you're going to be able to do certain things inside of it, maybe store items. I'm not sure. But, according to the sneak, this is actually going to be a housing system. So... Next up, we have the actual map, which is still a work in progress in Project Slayers. We can see it a little bit. And first off, you can just tell that this isn't very high quality, which is good. It's high quality, but it's low, mid medium, poly, which means that it's going to be suitable for a lot of devices. Okay, it's kind of like almost like a deep woken level of graphics, which is really good. It handles a lot of lower end computers. So that's good to see. And obviously it's still a work in progress. And based off what we can see, it's looking pretty good. Next, we can see this uh, viewpoint more of the map and uh, it's looking nice. I like it. Uh, this is, is this Butterfly Mansion? Let me know in the comments below. I could be wrong. But here goes the good parts. We have the video. So we're gonna go ahead and play this here. Nice. Also make sure you guys check out Q. Um, his channel Q Productions and then also you can join the Project Slayers Discord server link in the description So, okay, we can see here. This is going to be the customization menu for Project Slayers as we can see that is very nice. That's cool Okay, let's go ahead and put this on a <clears throat> Two times speed here and we can just see the level of good. That's great that they have the color specifier because now you could literally use whatever color you would actually like so that's very fire that's very cool and then we can also yeah very good very good so let's see what also you can do okay beard options very cool beard color very cool and let's see what this most popular part is okay so you can see customization back to this page that's cool the demon idol that's sick that's sick so yeah, we can see the based off so far and what we see, we have a little bit more options when it comes to customization and a lot more detail, in my opinion, in the loading screen. And the next up we have, I believe this is Docky, right? Docky? So we're gonna go ahead and check this out and let's see what it's all about. Okay, first off, I just wanna say the M1s are looking very cool. That's very, very, very cool. Okay, we can see, boom, boom, cool combo. Let's go ahead and uh, up the quality for a bit because this is pretty low quality. Dang. Boom, 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 slam. Let's see if we can see the ultimate ability. Is the alt shown in here? There should be an alt. Maybe I should just watch and stop trying to skip. Okay. Okay, I think that was a attempt at an alt hit that didn't hit. So what is, so what's that about? I didn't get it. 
Okay. And also, I'm just noticing this. The region is kind of uh, pretty high, but I guess people would be a little bit more aggressive. That's some beautiful VFX right there. Yeah, that's sick. Yo, that's a cool barrage. Okay. So I think that's going to be the main bit of the moveset. Well, I don't think I saw that ability. Oh, there's like a little ending. That's sick. Cool, cool, cool. So I guess that would probably be the ultimate ability. And and for this being Doki, such a weak moon and irrelevant moon, in my opinion, they just put a lot of effort and detail in it. And that is something I truly admire. So yeah, definitely drop a like on that. And then next up, we have Explosive Blood, which we actually reacted to in my previous video. But for the sake of this, I will go ahead and show you guys the ultimate on it because it's absolutely phenomenal. Like, yo, look at this. Get ready. It's crazy. Like, yo, drop kick, boom, scratch, 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 vicious, boom, axe kick down on the ground, beautiful VFX impact frames. That is a very sick ultimate ability and that is fire and then last but not least we have the dimension x showcase which is or my bad that's i'm not sure why it's called dimension x but this is Gutero, and we can just see the idols looking fire whoa that's right he can kind of like can't he project his blood or something like that let me know in the comments. I can't remember from when they fought with when he fought with Tengen in the Entertainment District. But yeah, just straight off the rip. The VFX is crazy. This is a big thing. I'm really hoping they have some good VFX settings because my PC can handle, you know, high visual effects. But my biggest worry is, you know, them not having that as an option, and then lower end device players can't enjoy the game because. They can't handle the visual effects so i'm hoping that is going to be fixed on and let's go ahead and see if we get oh yo pause hold on that's a little bit of copyright music but yo that's sick that was sick let me run that back hold on whoa what is that is that obanai I can't tell. I think that's Obanai, but that was crazy. I, I just love, the, the biggest thing that I love about Project Slayers is their ultimates are so well made, but they're not long. Like nobody wants to deal with, you know, 30, 40 second alt. By the time the alt's finished, he's got his buddies behind you and he's jumping you. That is great. So that is basically the main things that we've, that has been released thus far. Uh, within Project Slayers and the purpose of this video is to just hopefully spread more awareness if people don't know about the game because this is by far most likely going to be the best uh, Demon Slayer RPG that's going to be out on the market and um, yeah man I just want to let you guys know that bro so thank you guys for watching this video make sure you guys subscribe and uh, I'll see you guys on the next one peace